can have a lot of fun. Ah, what's up? <laughs> All right, so there you go, guys. Um, that was episode two of The Walking Dead. Pretty interesting. Um, no real story development, I should say. No real story development. It's more like um, we didn't learn anything new. We just, um, well, we did learn that um, the people that was there is connected to so the base camp is where shane is so that was new information i didn't know that they were connected with um with the shane's camp like with them i didn't know that the sister that she was talking about was actually a sister from where shane them is um but pretty interesting episode nonetheless okay Happy to know, get a little bit more information about about the walkers. Um, they can, they know people who aren't dead by their smell. Um, we already knew that they were attracted to noise. Um, that was pretty cool to know. It was pretty, um, very strategic how they got out of their situation. I didn't like the fact that Shaden didn't even consider the fact to go and look to go and get him to see if he can actually do the same thing that they did which is try to pull them away with noise so that they can escape something come up with some idea don't just write people off you know what i'm saying like for me in that situation I, w I i would be thinking is there some way that we can go and help them figure out something if you know enough about the what the the walkers right if you know enough about the walkers and i'm it because it's so close to to you know the um the White Walkers from Game of Thrones, so I don't want to call them White Walkers. They call them Walkers, just Walkers, okay? So it's crazy. It's crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? So how they got out is pretty interesting. Rick is out here leading these guys, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I dig his character. I like the stuff that he said to um, the dude that called um, black dude the nigger and stuff like that it was also wrong of the black the black lady it was also wrong of her to call dude a cracker like i don't i don't condone regardless of who it is racism is racism okay racism is racism it doesn't matter who's doing it okay people tend to think that black people can't be racist oh oh yes they can very much so okay so my thing is racism is racism um he outright called dude a nigger you know what i'm saying so it, it, it's um and, and she called dude a cracker like i i do not like those terms i tend to not use those those words like for me it's um i refer to my fellow black guys as niggas you know what i'm saying because i say it every time of time i use i use the n-word but it's different for us, but when you put the the R the E E R at the end, it's it's just it's different, okay? Um, but I don't want to go into stuff like that. I just just wanted to address that part of it. Like, I was like, whoa, you know what I'm saying? Because as much as we we know that it happens, it's still very surprising to when you see it in a TV show or on screen, it's like, whoa, he really went there. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't think that this was, that it was going to be a, 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 a racist moment. Like I didn't expect it. So it was like very surprising to me, but, and then all of them just stood there and watched, they're watching the guy beat up on the guy. And I'm like, why are you doing that? Why don't try to get him off? I mean, Rick tried and got, I think he got elbowed in the face or something like that. Um, so that, that was, um, pretty interesting to see in the show. So we got, um, them heading away. I guess they're heading to base camp. I don't know if base camp left, you know, they were trying to contact them. So they know they're, that they're in trouble. Still don't like the relationship between Shane and Rick's wife. Like that's, that's not cool. It's not cool. Um, but very interesting nonetheless this episode so i thank you guys for watching man it's been awesome um this episode was really um um we didn't learn much 
as in story progression, but at least we know they got out of there and they left dude on the top of the roof. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if they did that as poetic justice because he dropped the N word. You know what I'm saying? In the episode, I don't know if that's why they did it. Uh, but um, he didn't deserve to die. As you see, I was trying to say, dude, give him the hacksaw. If you know, you drop the key, give him the hacksaw. At least he can save himself. If you don't have the time to save him, at least he can save himself. But he didn't do that. He was trying to get through to the truck. Um, um, but that was weird how he dropped the key. And I mean, he should have remembered about the hacksaw. He should have, you know, hopefully dude um, gets away because the dude did lock the door so they wouldn't be able to get to him. So that was pretty cool of him to do at the same time. But episode was pretty good. I liked it, you know. Um, looking forward to episode three, of course. I changed the background, guys. Um, the last background that I had up, you guys said it has spoilers in it because the character was, there's a character in it that wasn't introduced yet. Um, you, you guys were saying that it's from season six or something like that. I, I don't remember exactly. I think you guys said it was from season seven. So it was, um... Or something like that. Because that character hasn't been introduced yet. I didn't know that. I just put it up for the first episode. I, I don't know who's going to show. Who's not going to show. I just found a, a wallpaper. And I just put it put it there. You know. But now I'm pretty sure this shot is from season one. Because this is the highway shot right here. Let me take myself out for a second. So you guys can see. As you can see. This is the shot from him riding into the, to, to Atlanta. So. I'm pretty sure you guys would appreciate the fact that I changed that. Okay. So that was pretty cool. Okay. So yes, I'm back. <laughs> All right. So great episode. Not a lot of story progression as I, as I said, but it was still very interesting how to see, learn, learn something about the walkers and how they speak, um, learn how these characters are thinking. Okay. I think Glenn is going to be one of those guys. It's going to be very funny going forward. So, um, so yeah, I'm guessing there's more to learn about this. We only two episodes in. So thank you guys for watching once again. Hopefully um, that you guys um, keep watching this series with me and supporting the review videos on YouTube because um, I'm really liking this series. So far, so good. Um, great start, great build up episodes are, are, are progressing nicely they're not as long i mean i think the first one was like an hour i think the second one is only like 40 minutes it looked like it was a one hour premiere but it looks like it's gonna go down to like um this one was about 40 something minutes so that was pretty cool okay so i it's not that i hate reacting to longer episodes it's it's the fact that when when it's shorter it's easier to edit takes a take a lot less time to render out so i can get these episodes up quicker okay so it's not a problem if i if if i have a preference like that okay so thank you guys for watching once again make sure that you subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you know when the next walking dead episode is out okay if you have not if you don't know i'm gonna say it again if you cannot watch the video in your country OK, I've said this in many of my channel update um, videos. OK, if you cannot watch it in your country, you usually should still be able to see the comments on the video. If not, but you it is seen as blocked, send me a message. Go into the, the discussion tab or just go to one of the videos, one of the review videos. Leave a comment. I will see the comment and I will send you the link for you to watch it on Google. Um, on my Google Drive, okay? The videos are there. That's where all of my full-length um, reactions are at. So you can go watch the episode, come back, watch the review of the episode, and then leave your comment on the video, leave a like. That's the situation, okay? So thank you guys for watching because I, do, I just don't want to shortchange my community. I just don't want to shortchange. I don't want to change up my format. I don't want to... Um, um, put a, 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 a little tiny screen there and you're straining your eyes to see it. Like, I just don't want to change my format 
for that reason. I'd rather find a a way that you guys can access these videos and and um at the same format, the same set um 1080p whatever the situation is, you can watch the episodes on your own time and whatever. But also, all I'm asking you to do is to come back to YouTube watch the review of the episode and leave your comments there so that we still have a presence on youtube and i'm still grow on youtube okay so thank you guys for watching once again i've said that like five times i know so leave a like leave a comment of course on this review and thank you guys for watching once again okay <laughs> this is your boy this has been terabyte reacts and peace